Security on the floor, please. Keep your eye on the floor. We're going to do it one time. One time for the R Street crew, Big Rano and Donnell and Mo and Dingo. That's what the problem is. Uh, we ain't hollering no more of these names here. Let's talk about these honeys here. Shit. Keep hollering all these fellas' names. They get jealous of one another. I've never seen so many fellas get jealous of one another because we call your name. We're going to stop calling your name. Stop calling the honeys' name. Because if they fight, they might be all right. Shit. Why make the night go even better? Huh? We don't want nobody in here fighting for real. I don't understand why the band stopped playing and uh, everybody disappear. Do what, darling? One second, Trevor, before you get busy, boss. Huh? I did. I already did. <laughs> That's too old for some of these, for some of this uh, crew out here, you know what I'm saying? We got to put the 89 groove on it, you know what I'm saying? Ladies and gentlemen, uh, everybody had a beautiful holiday today, I know I did. And if you didn't, that was your problem, because nobody wants your shit, you keep your own shit with you. But uh, when you come up in here, ladies and gentlemen, if you ain't feeling right, Feeling bad and all that kind of shit. Don't come up here and depress everybody else because you won't come up here and fight and shit like that. We don't want that. We don't even want to look at you. Stay home and fight your daddy and fight your mama. Let them, let them straighten out. Talk it over with somebody. Only way you're going to get rid of the problem is talk about it. You understand? If you're going to hold it in, hold it in and uh, try to handle it yourself, you ain't going to get done like that. Just because somebody did your girlfriend or she did your man, and you talk about it, it might have been something you weren't doing right. They you stepped on your toes or stepped on your shoes, you know what I'm saying? You can expect that. Wear your house shoes in here. You know, something like that. You wear your white tennis shoes and all that. I know you don't want to get messed up because I don't want to get mine messed up. Soon as, especially when you just bought them from the store. But when you come to go-go, you dance. That's what it is. You dance. You know, we don't stand in one spot and dance. 
We move all around the floor. That's why you got a big old, big old floor out there. Great big old floor. So you can dance around the floor. You understand? If you can't get with that, you understand? You gotta, you gotta learn how to dance. If you can't dance, go downstairs. They got a little floor downstairs for people that can't dance upstairs. You know what I'm saying? But I can't stand two people on, with two left feet dancing on my floor, throwing everybody off beat. Throw me off beat when I watch Jim Lee dance. <laughs> yes. So uh, I think y'all got an order. Is it in order, uh, officer? It was right back there between them two poles right there. Yeah. I ain't gonna tell who it was this time. I, I knew who that one was. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Who's that, Chris? Huh? Oh. <laughs> the funk are like, okay. That one you this time wasn't Steve. No. <laughs> That's my man Steve here. Yeah, yeah he, he watching y'all. You see him up there, fellas? Watch him. Watch him and Tim. Tim, what Steve don't leave with, Tim going to take. Yeah, you see him moving on. Now. Is that some? No, that's not Tasha. Is that Tasha? No, that's not Tasha. Who that represents you, man? I, I can't see her earrings too clear. I don't have my bifocals on. <laughs> Such a lovely couple. That must be your main man. He's holding on you tight, darling. <laughs> That's what you got to do around here. We got there's a whole lot of wolves in here, fellas. My man, you know what I'm saying? Just like you holler for. <laughs> 